How's it going, Radio Western? My name's Elijah, as always, and welcome back to another edition of What's Western Listening To. Love is in the air. It, we're just around the corner from Valentine's Day, so we're going to be asking people about some love songs today. Not exactly what they're listening to, but what makes them think of love, which songs they associate with it or with that special someone. So, as always, let's get started. All right, so I'm standing here with Taylor. Now, Taylor, if you could be serenaded by any artist that you can possibly think of, who would it be? Justin Timberlake. Justin Timberlake. Okay, I like it. Are we talking in sync era Justin Timberlake, or are we talking like new, like like daddy Justin Timberlake? In sync era. Really? Yeah. Oh, you, you okay? You like like the the oodles and noodles hair type? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Fair enough. Yeah. No. No. That's that's. I like that. I like that choice. All right, so I'm standing here with Western for Ooch, but more specifically, I'm here with Trent and Aiden. All right, Trent and Aiden. So, do you guys like love songs? Of course, everyone loves love songs. Ain't that the truth? Do you like love songs? I do like love songs. Sure. Perfect. Are you guys getting ready for the uh, the Valentine's Day season with any uh, songs? Do you have a favorite love song? I'm gonna have to say "Thinking Out Loud" by Ed Sheeran. When your legs don't work like that is a classic. Yeah, 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 that's like a perfect wedding song, eh? Yeah, is that one that you're thinking about doing for your uh, for your eventual wedding? Uh, maybe you know, there's a lot of options, but uh, that's my favorite right now. For sure, for sure. Now, um, it could be Ed Sheeran, but if you could be serenaded by one artist, who would it be? And if a song came up in mind, feel free. Oh my gosh, it'd be Carrie Underwood, hands down. I I don't know what song. Mm-hmm. You know, she has a lot of songs about not necessarily love, but uh, kind of like scary killing her ex-boyfriend song so i was about to say that yeah you better stay in love with her because she'll slash your tires and louisville slugger your car and everything like that but yeah i I think that's a good choice yeah yeah what about her makes you want to be serenaded just her voice or you know her voice and she's she's beautiful you know and that's about it i'd say all right so i'm standing here with abdul all right abdul first of all Props to you for not wearing a coat, man. Like you're, you must be Superman or something. So I'm f- also hot inside. So when I got out, I just left my coat here, and I'm okay with this. What with the yeah hoodie, yeah. Good for you, because I'm still freezing in this massive coat. So, but uh, to get back onto topic, uh, do you like love? Do you like love songs? It depends on the song. Like okay. I'm usually not. I don't listen to the genre love songs. Mm-hmm. But if there's uh, like a singer I like, then I I might like the music she or he does. Yeah. Do you have a favorite love song that you can think of? Hmm. So I'm more of a Taylor Swift uh, like fan. Nice. So I think she had like sort of a new remix. It's called Lover. Um, I listened to that one a bit. Yeah, yeah. And also her previous ones like Blank Space mm-hmm. or Gorgeous. I also listened to these guys to these songs as well. Now she's yeah she's kind of the queen of love songs and breakup songs too. Do you like her breakup songs as well? You could say so. I know there are lots of memes that she always uh, has boyfriends and the songs about them. Yeah. But she sort of addressed that, that that's just her type of music and that's what she does her music best about. So, like, I get that that's what she wants to sing about. Now, it doesn't have to be Taylor Swift by any means, but if you could be serenaded by one particular artist uh, performing a song or anything like that, do you know who it would be? Hmm. Probably Katy Perry has some good songs as well. She does. So I wouldn't take her off my options as well. An option between T Swift and uh, and Katy Perry, those are some good options. I wouldn't mind being serenaded by either of them, so I agree. I, I like that. Not friends at the moment, but you know you can listen to both of them. Who who cares? In this made-up scenario, it doesn't even matter. So <laughs> maybe they can both serenade you. Until Taylor, right? <laughs> promise, I promise. And then finally, do you have a certain song that makes you think of a certain somebody, or like one song that just makes you think back to like a like a first dance or like a first crush or anything like that? Yeah, I mean, uh, also, I was reading on the internet, you know, like, you like someone when you listen to the song and uh, think about them. Yeah. So, for sure, I mean, and Taylor does have, like, breakup songs and crushes and stuff like that. Mm-hmm. Um, like, yeah, for example, I think in Gorgeous, he says, there's nothing I hate more than what I cannot have. So, yeah, for sure, sometimes it does, like, bring memories or feelings or stuff that, you know, worked or didn't work out. Sure. It, it does make you think about it, for sure, yeah. Perfect. Well, thank you so much for taking the time out. Hey, I really appreciate it. So I'm standing here with... Sophie and Nicole. All right. Sophie and Nicole, do you guys like love songs? Yes. Yeah, yeah. yeah. 
When you think of a love song, like what's the first thing that comes to mind? Um, Can't Help Falling in Love, Elvis Presley. Whoa. Oh, that's a classic. Yeah, I actually heard someone saying that, talking about that song earlier today. What about that song makes you love it so much? I think, well, Elvis Presley is just like Elvis Presley. But I think just like the slow tempo and just like it's very just like true and like simple. Yeah. What about you? Um, I think of Speechless by Dan and Shay. You already know that you're my weakness. After all this time, I'm just as nervous. Every time you walk into the room. It's like a country song, but their music video is actually from both of their weddings. So, and they're like singing to their wives in the song. It's so cute, yeah. Oh my God. That's really cute. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is that a recent song or? Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Perfect. So is that like a potential wedding song for you in the future? Ooh, yeah, probably. <laughs> it's so sweet. Yeah, I think so. Fair enough. Now, uh, if you guys could be serenaded, it doesn't have to be Elvis or Dan and Shay, but if you could be serenaded by one artist or one group, do you know who it would be? Oh, now that you say group, I don't know. My first pick would have been Harry Styles. Oh my god, okay, I was thinking that too. <laughs> same, same. Love him. Yeah. yeah. For which reason? Just because of his voice or his like his style, which is flawless? It's like everything about him. His whole just, vibe. Yeah, everything. Do you have a particular song that you would want him, that you would request for him to do? Oh, all of them. All of I them. can't <laughs> pick. I can't pick. Maybe I know everyone you. off by heart. Adore you, Sid. Yeah. Thank you.